Hey guys, welcome to Outlaw Edge Blade Works. <clears throat> so a while back I got these at uh, Harbor Freight. And this is just a cheaper set of uh, ball end, dang it, sorry about that, uh, ball end Allen socket T-handles. And you can see here they have the regular style Allen heads here on the top and then the ball ends on the top on the bottom. And uh, this weekend, or last weekend, I'm sorry, uh, when I was out cruising around and we went to drop some parts and stuff off, goofing off at my buddy's house, uh, we stopped by this, uh, it was like a flea market swap meet deal. And they had this, uh, I'm not sure how you pronounce this, but it's Bondhaus, I think is how you pronounce it. But this whole set right here, and it was only missing one, but it's one of those that is so small that you'd never use it anyways. You know, like this, these four right here, I'll probably never use. But this set here is what I really wanted. But uh, they have this this screwdriver style Allen wrenches, <clears throat> and they're really nice. Oh, I'm throwing stuff on the floor. Sorry about that. I'm trying to get this set up so I can get my frame here. But they're really nice because uh, when you're using an Allen wrench or an Allen socket uh, hex bolt, when you have these style uh, Allen sockets or Allen. Uh, tools that have the round head on them you can really get in there <clears throat> you know you can put them in straight like this or you could turn them at an angle so that you could turn the uh, bolt that makes it really nice because if you have a spot that's kind of hard to get to you can you know really get in there and uh, come in at an angle in the bolt and then put that you know get your bolt started or whatever but these are a really nice set and I ended up getting this whole set for 10 bucks and I was pretty stoked about that so I wanted to show you guys but it came with this nice holder uh, somebody must have made this it looks like you know some of the electrical uh, I forget what they call it that uh, the bracket that they used to use uh, in buildings to hook up elect electrical lines and hold them on the wall or whatever it's shaped like a U but uh, somebody took the time of drilling all these holes and putting these in there made it really nice so i'm gonna just hang it on the wall in the garage and that way when i need to use it or whatever but it goes all the way up to three eighths and it's a nice little set and i really like my set that i got from harbor freight i used the hell out of this set and it's probably one of my most used tools in the garage i'm always using this set right here I, I, what i'll do is i'll just throw it on the welding table or i'll throw it on my my workbench so i think what i'm gonna do on this one i'm gonna just bolt it right to the side of my tool cart and it should be pretty nice and uh, this Bondhaus brand, like I said, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but this brand is just, it's a really good brand. And it's, uh, let me see if I can get this to focus. There you go. And uh, they're just, they're awesome Allen wrenches. I mean, you can, you know, beat the crap out of these ones. And, and I've never had any of these twist up because uh, like these cheap Harbor Freight ones, you can pull them out go to use them on a bolt and some of these uh cheaper harbor freight style allen wrenches like this they'll end up twisting where it'll be you know the allen wrench itself will be twisted up if you uh wrench on them too hard so you kind of got to be careful with those ones but these ones i've never had that problem with i mean you can just beat on them they got a really good tool still but uh figured i'd show you guys what i got pretty excited about putting these on the side of my tool cart should be should be really nice to have these in the in the garage pretty stoked about this but uh, anyways, hope I didn't bore you guys. Kind of wanted to show you what I got going on. Thanks for watching.